Welcome back to the channel where we explore, learn, and theorize about the Marvel Universe. Today I'll be talking about Scarlett Johansson returning to the MCU, Sony making a Miles Morales movie, and how many characters will be in Doctor Strange 2. Now let's get started. After everything that happened between Disney and Scarlett Johansson over Black Widow recently, I never would have expected her to return, especially to the MCU. But as Kevin Feige just confirmed, Johansson has returned and this time is working with Marvel Studios as a producer on a top secret project. And while it's been said that this doesn't have to do with her Black Widow character, I don't think that immediately takes Black Widow completely out of the question. Because while Natasha is dead in the MCU, this project could be Black Widow 2 focusing on Florence Pugh's Yelena Belova. And to be honest, since they're already working together again so soon after the lawsuit, I wouldn't be surprised if she did return as Black Widow in the future for something like Secret Wars or just in flashbacks and other projects. Next, according to Daniel Rickman, Sony are interested in making a live-action Miles Morales movie most likely also set in the MCU, since he was teased in Spider-Man Homecoming and Electro apparently references him in Spider-Man No Way Home. Something that I've heard people talk about though is that the MCU's Peter Parker is too young to be a mentor already since after No Way Home he'll only be starting college. But if you think about it, our Peter's been Spider-Man for more than 4 years has fought with the Avengers multiple times, went to space, defeated Thanos, fought villains from different universes alongside other Spider-Men, fought against Doctor Strange, and done much more. So while he's not at the age he'd normally be in the comics or on other stories, and the age difference might be much smaller in the MCU, he's never been this super wise mentor. He's always been Spider-Man, and while teaching Miles he makes just as many mistakes in both his teachings and his time as a superhero. Also in the Spider-Man PS4 game, Peter is 23, and has been Spider-Man for only 8 years, and when Miles gets bit, he's 17. So while the age difference there is a bit more, and that Spider-Man's been doing it for twice as long, our Spidey has experience in different areas that are actually better suited to the MCU. And lastly, while we already know that there will be a ridiculous amount of characters in Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness, a new Funko Pop listing on Amazon confirmed that we're getting a minimum of 15 new Pops, which confirms that there will be at least 15 major characters in the movie. But let me know what you guys think about all this. Would you like to see Scarlett Johansson return in the MCU, do you think it's too early to introduce Miles Morales, and how excited are you for Doctor Strange 2? If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on post notifications so you'll never miss another video. Thanks for watching, and remember to wash your hands and stay safe.